On the 3rd of August 2016, the local government elections took place countrywide. Citizens were given the opportunity to exercise their right to vote. I, I just uh, felt that it's, it's important that we vote, uh, that we are heard firstly, and secondly, people died for us to come in and be able to vote, so um, I, couldn't, I couldn't stay in my room. We asked voters about what their general experience was in terms of the voting process this year. I don't know, it was so weird. I expected it to be more full than it is right now, but it was, I don't know, I, I didn't have the excitement that I thought I'd have. I was coming here. Yeah. Uh, I just sort of went along with it. It was no like explanation or anything. It was just like just go there, okay, and then they just gave you the ballot, and then you just sort of figure it out yourself when you're reading the papers and stuff. Yeah. I'm currently at the Great Hall venue at the university, currently known as Rhodes, where people are casting their votes for this year's local elections. The turnout this morning started off a bit slow, but numbers seem to be picking up. Well, um, it was easier than I expected, to be honest. At last elections. It took quite a while, but now I was in and out, maximum 10 minutes, so I was happy about that. Yeah. I, I like the fact that it's easy and it's no fuss and no mess, in and out. Everybody inside is helpful and the process went smoothly because of that, so I think job well done. Young voters also spoke to us about the importance of voting in local government elections. Well, I mean, I think local elections are more important than national elections because it affects the place where you actually live. So, I mean, you, you, need, to, you need to decide who runs where you, you actually stay. I think that's very important. Overall, it can be said that the voting process has been easy and has run smoothly for voters. The only thing now we can do is patiently wait for the results. I'm Tingo Luenko Sazanem Tombeni, reporting from Grahamstown.